Okay, sports fans, so we're going to pressure test the um, one of the cells today and um, we've got the system here set up on about 40 amps of not bothering with uh, meter shunts and meters. Well, I know it's about 40 amps. So we're using this, we'll go outside today and we're using uh, one cell through the bubbler and uh, coming into the cell under test in a tank of water and I'm using the um, torch control there to pressurise the system so I want to see if it can comfortably go up to about as I close this off the pressure will rise so we'll just that's the normal flow so we'll just limit it down to uh, something like well, we'll just get the pressure up to start. What I don't like about this system here is the hoses. And the hoses are pushed on firmly, but they can blow off when the pressure builds up to about probably 10 psi. And you don't want the electrolyte coming out. It's not good. So this system here, as you can possibly see has got um, the tubes have got a grind a ring ground into them and there's uh, stainless steel lock wire compressing the hose onto the fitting there so I've lock wired all the uh, tubes in that fashion for safety pressure's building up let's take this torch out so we don't want the bubbles in there, we're looking for bubbles by the way because that cell is pressurised with gas at the moment from this cell let's turn the tap right off and get that pressure up and hopefully the hoses won't blow off so I'll be happy if I can get up to uh, 10 psi without any leaks out of this cell and there's absolutely no bubbles coming out of that one yet. So there we are up to uh, 9 psi and rising, getting a bit above my comfort level. We're past 10. Let some of that pressure out. Stabilise it a bit. We're over 11 psi at the moment. And uh, absolutely no bubbles, zero leaks at a comfortable 10 psi. And this gauge tends to underread a bit. Let's let that pressure out. Consider this cell is uh, in a serviceable condition to um, put into long term operation. Forty amps and uh, probably less than twelve volts with the one cell. And we're looking pretty good there. Thanks for watching.